la 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 happy halloween to you <laughs> crazy zero taste that's a lot of information in one statement oh hold on guys so for the record they're trying to call me i tried to answer and the fucking phone wouldn't answer <laughs> So now I gotta see what's going on. I, I assume they're leaving a voicemail, and I'm probably gonna have to call them back. So give me a second, guys. All right. Well, now I'm not. Now the call. I got a call. I tried to answer. It didn't answer, and I don't think they left the voicemail. <laughs> Great. Well, hopefully I get another call. I don't know what's going on. That was stupid. This does happen sometimes with cell phones. And like I told you guys, I don't have great reception. So I'll get a call. I want to answer. It won't even pick up. <laughs> can I answer? Can I talk? No. It won't pick up. Oh, good. <clears throat> so nothing. Like I said, I got the call, but nothing. Now there's not no second call and no voicemail. <laughs> and sadly, it's an 800 number. If I call it back, it's just going to go to an 800 number anyway. <clears throat> I tried calling, but I know what's going to happen. It's just going to go to a voicemail. Let's see. I was right. It's just the automated line. Likely what it was is I, I had already gotten a text update saying the tech is going to be here within like half an hour. That was 15 minutes ago. So likely this was a phone call. Just her tell it say the, exactly the same thing, but it's completely automated. When you call, it's just a robot. Why don't I go outside and wait? Because I don't live on an open city street. I live in a private community. The person, regardless, is going to have to call me so I can get them in, and then they have to drive to the back here. They're not going to just arrive at the front of my house. I'm not on an open public road. They obviously have my number, and they're going to call me when they arrive, like they always do. Ah, okay. Yeah, this is great. My fucking phone won't pick up. <laughs> oh my god. I just got a call. They're trying to get in the front gate, I think, and I, I can't fucking pick up. I'm trying to answer on my phone, and it won't pick up the call. Isn't that great? <laughs> I don't know if it's because my reception is so bad or what, but I don't know what to do here. This sucks. I gotta try. I don't know. I might have to call them directly and try to figure out what's going on. Ugh. <sighs> Oh my god! I, I apologize, I kept everyone on the edge of their seats here wondering what's going on. Someone just said that in the chat. They're like, oh my god, we're on the edge of our seats. So the tech is here, he's figuring it out. He does think it is a DNS issue. And uh, I'm gonna go offline. And we're gonna try to fix it, alright guys? So I'll hopefully be back, you know, later this afternoon, sooner rather than later. But we'll see. And I will let you all know what happened. Thanks for being patient. And I'll be back in a bit, everyone, alright? Thanks for watching, and I shall be back whenever it's resolved. Thanks, and see you in a bit. We are about to get started. As they say, better late than never, right? Better late than never. Why not do one long stream to make up for it? Because then I can't eat, genius. I have to eat dinner. I haven't eaten. What am I going to do? Be starving all day long? No, I have to. Eat. I'm a human. I have to eat food, you know, like a normal person. So we're going to be doing, like I said, around two hours of gameplay now, then a break for dinner, and then I'll come back tonight. Uh, and do it like a two to two and a half hour stream so we'll get a good amount of gameplay in okay oh we kept all the contributions from earlier they continue as if this was all one stream that would be pretty messed up to not count those contributions uh towards the stream it is for the premiere all right any contributions would be greatly greatly appreciated everybody king manuel if you say play hard mode again i'm just going to completely block your account so i never see you ever again <laughs> Now is not the time to test me with this bullshit and start with this hard mode nonsense. My life is hard mode enough. My life is hard mode enough. I don't need more challenges. Alright? I have enough challenges. Ugh. Ugh. <clears throat> That's right. If only I weren't so old. If only I were young. Ugh. I could stay up past, you know, 8 p.m. and not be yawning like a, you know, like a grandpa. Uh. <clears throat> I can't even just turn the fucking internet on and stream a game like everybody else. I don't need hard mode, all right? You play hard mode. Here's what you do. You buy the game, you play hard mode yourself. Tell me how it is. I'm very interested to hear how hard mode is for you. For me, I'll be a, a normal person who doesn't measure the size of my e-penis based off of the difficulty of the game I play, and I'll be enjoying Alan Wake 2 on standard difficulty, okay? So there you have it. <clears throat> I'm gay, I'm gay, I'm gay. What the fuck? My audio just went out, by the way. Uh, do you guys have audio? You do?
No, I don't. The audio just died. The game just had a glitch and the audio died. What just happened? <laughs> it's silent. Oh, uh, this is a game. This is a glitch. This is 100% a glitch. This is interesting. What are we? What's going on? There's no audio, right? <laughs> uh, the cursed game continues, I guess. There's still audio in the console. It's the game. The game has glitched with no audio. Are you kidding me? So what do I do now? There is no hot patch. I checked for an update and there's no update. You're full of crap. Uh, so, so what do I do? We play with no audio. A big bloated naked dude and uh, no audio. That's interesting. Will this fix itself? That's really weird. That's the game. Boy, this game is haunted. The power goes out. The internet goes out. The audio goes out. What's next? Jesus Christ, man. This is just wild. Oh, wait, guys, I warn them all of you, you should try to defend yourselves from this curse, too. Okay, we have audio now. Who is this naked, bloated dude we're playing as? He's got a nice ass. Nice and bloated. Disgusting. He's covered in sludge. This is a great way to start the game. Come on, Ed. That's a soggy ass. There you go. This You guys don't realize this. This is my created character. I actually did a full body scan of myself. And this is me accurately represented in the game. It's my body type. That makes sense, actually. At one point, this was my body type. But I have lost weight recently, so... <laughs> I guess this is what happens when you get in a, so in a lake for 13 years. This is how you look. Your body just absorbs the lake for 13 years. You're nice and bloated. Looks like he has to take a big one, if you know what I mean. Like, he's bloated and just needs to release. A nice, a nice, relaxing release. Oh, jeez! <laughs> Come on, man! Look at this! Yeah, I just had a relaxing release in my pants. Jeez! Nice jump scare. What a horrible jump scare! I'm so terrified by the water. Yeah, I found this beanie in my closet. I, You know how old this black beanie is? I'm not kidding. I, I remember wearing this to MAGFest 2007. Whatever MAGFest it was that I went to, not the one that I went to as a YouTuber, but before I was a YouTuber, I wore this during that event. So that's how old this black beanie is. <laughs> and I still have it. There you go. <laughs> it's kind of tight, actually. I think maybe my head has grown or something, or I just haven't worn it in so long that's not stretched out. So now my hair's gonna get all flat. There we go, black beanie. It's kind of weird. It's weird. Anyway, so thank you for for that. Let's uh, do a, a pull for a vest now. This looks really weird. It doesn't really go with the flannel, does it? It doesn't go with the flannel at all. This black beanie on my head. All right. You use the shortcut key. Now you can walk through the gate and like up this nice hill, so just far. don't be late. Burgess aside. He can't see me in the light. My gun's out in the hall. Gotta get it back. Safe havens restore some of your hell. If you leave or attack from a safe haven while in combat, it becomes temporarily unavailable. Go! She literally said go, so I went and it was instant death. Wow, thanks for the advice, stupid. She doesn't have her flashlight. Must be locked from the other side. My gun's out in the hall. Gotta get it back. Well, I'm out of time anyway, so this is a good place to end when I resume tonight.